Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Would you want AI to help you with filling some form in Filament? Today I will present you another project that we introduced in our Filament Examples Premium Project Set, filling form field value, select field value based on other value of another field in the form. As I typically do on YouTube, I will show you the code, the main part of it, and the full source code is available in the repository of Filament Examples Premium Membership Required. So, how it works? The idea came from my own project where I wanted to analyze job offers of Laravel, and I recently tweeted about it, took 50 random Laravel jobs, and asked AI to get the tags from them. This is the result already published, and I will link that tweet in the description below. But basically what I did is went to large jobs or other sources like LinkedIn, go to job description, and then copy-paste blindly the job descriptions, hoping for tags. So I guess this is enough. We don't need the payment details. So I'm pasting it into filament form description. And then I have a button extract tags, which calls the OpenAI API. And I will show you the code in a minute. And look what happens. And this is the result. The select field is automatically populated with tags of various technologies used in that job description. And then you can filter, maybe accept some of them, or it may be more complicated validation process. But basically, all I need to do then is click create, and that is saved in the database. So yeah, how does it work in the code? So we have the job offer resource, a typical filament resource with a typical form, but this part is important action below the description text area action extract tags with calling the open ai service a php class that i will show in a minute there's a function retrieve tags my own custom function with get description as a parameter so we're passing the text area value we get the tags and then we set the tags which automatically sets the select make values here now what is inside that retrieve tags for description this is a service PHP or Laravel class in app services, which has a few methods inside. So send OpenAI query, and then inside of that send OpenAI query, what do we have? First, we form the query from blade view. So did you know that you can do that in Laravel? So blade view, it doesn't necessarily have to be HTML. And then you have parameters here. So this is the prompt to the AI. Then we pass that prompt as query with HTTP request like you would do in any Laravel project, there's OpenAI API, this is the model, and you also need to have API key that you can take from this page on platform OpenAI API keys, you can generate the key pretty easily. And then you need to parse the result, there were some debugging here, replacing some string things, and the result comes from json message content so this is the result and then we call create tags another private function of that service parse tags from response works like this again some string operations and then create tags is first or create so we immediately create the tag in the database and then it's our choice to select or deselect them in the form so yeah if we go back to job offer resource again tags would return us the array of tags here in that function and then we set that array with array merged with previous values of those tags and if we save that data the full form we click create and then in the database we have the table of tags here without any ordering and then we have job offers here saved and also job offer tag which is a many-to-many -many pivot table so yeah it's relatively easy to enable ai assistance to work on populating some field values in filament forms what do you think would you have done something differently that's my usual question let's discuss in the comments below and if you want the full source code it will be available if you purchase premium membership which will give you access to this repository and inside of that repository in the forms there will be a form of OpenAI API call, inform this with full source of that project and read me with instructions and tutorial. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.